Hey guys, back, and I've already killed a few mantises and stuff off camera, and it's crazy. I got on the Therizinosaur, by the way. I'm over here with the Therizinosaur Terry, and he's the best at getting chitin over there. It, apparently, according to the wiki, he's even better than the Megalosaurus, or... Yeah, no, not Megalosaurus, uh, Megatherium. He's even better than the Megatherium. I'm over here in the swampy area of the, of the mountain area. I killed, like, all the mantises that were on the mountain. But we were getting, like, 250, sometimes 300 plus, I guess, depending on what level the, uh, the mantis was. 250 to 300 plus chitin per mantis. So I'm over here in the swampy area because I looked up there at the, at the uh, at the castle. I was like, you know what? Terry's so good at getting chitin. Oh, and there's another beehive thing right there. Ooh, she's so good at getting chitin. We might as well try and go to that castle. Where was that at? Oh, it was right here. Oh, here it is right here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> I don't even know where I'm at. Jeez. I, I guess we can go to that castle, but of course we need to build, like, like I guess foundations and stuff across. Oh, Capricucus right there. Oh, Scorpion right here. Ooh, let's kill the Scorpion. So let's see how much uh, chitin I get off the Scorpion. 34 chitin off the Scorpion. Well, I guess you just get more chitin in general off of the... Uh, off of, oh, big ol' Sarkis right here, though, 155 damage per hit, nice. And half the dead flush. And get the, oh, what in the world? Oh, Cabrasuka's behind me, Cabrasuka's behind me. Kill the Cabrasuka's, sheesh, I didn't even, like, touch it in this dead. <laughs> uh, looks like I'm getting hit by, like, Mega Ron or something in the, in the water, too. Oh, yeah, and I killed, like, a, a trike, an alpha trike. It was an alpha trike, but I didn't kill it alone. It was already, oh, man, that's right there, perfect. And a Sarkis I didn't kill it alone. It was already like half dead. I was, I'm doing like 155 damage or so per hit. And with, with two, oh, and there's the mantis right there. With two hits per attack, which is crazy good. Let's go harvest the mantis here in a second. Let's get the wood out of my inventory. And uh, of course, you know, these mantises and stuff do drop. Uh, I'm just having 235 chitin from that mantis. Man, that is good stuff. And of course, we get organic polymer as well, which we also need too. That is awesome. All right, well, I don't even know what I was talking about five seconds ago. Jeez, eh, that's not really that new, right? <laughs> Uh, anyways, we can just keep going around here. Oh, yeah, I, I killed that alpha trike. Uh, I got some stuff. Oh, yeah, we got some, like, black pearls and uh, some other stuff. Trike helmet and even a sapphire and some other stuff here as well. So that's pretty good. P prime hide, prime chitin and all that kind of stuff. Also killed some green tribes people and uh, unfortunately Terry ate most of the kibble. But I do have a two Sarkis egg, two Asarko egg kibble and one Ankylo egg kibble right there. So that's pretty cool. Anyways, uh, that's the thing, though, is that the tribes people don't seem to drop uh, their kibbles and stuff, unless, like, a critter kills it. If I kill a tribes person, he doesn't seem to drop anything, so that's kind of dumb, but if I kill him with, like, Terry, of course, he's gonna try and eat it, like, because it's in his inventory, so I need to watch a heck out for that, so I get- Oh, yeah, you can see, like, uh, some of the stuff up there already. You can see some of the stuff. Yeah, look at that. We got spiders, we got well, I guess the, the the bat critters, the Oni, Onis? I, I've never pronounced these guys. I always just call them bats and spiders and stuff. <laughs> Anyways, uh, I guess maybe we go around this mountain. We'll, I guess we'll find our way up or something like that. We'll be coming around. Oh, here we go. We'll be coming around the mountain when we, oh, another man just up there. Let's go kill it. Let's go get insane amount to hide. Oh, yeah, we have low ups. And I've got, we do have, oh, wow, up to level 78 already. Nice. We do have, like, secondary level ups, like power attack level ups we need to do for carry here in a pit. Might as well. Oh, 217 chitin right there. Nice. Let's see if anything's inside of the bag. Any juicy loot. Oh, a sickle and a whip. Uh, I don't know if I need the whip. Uh, at least we'll get a little bit of metal from the sickle. Anyways, uh, 12 levels right there. No, whoops. Let's do, let's do all that up to power harvesting. 146%. Oh, wow. We're going to go over 100, 150.7%. Additional power harvesting, nice, 152.2, nice. Anyways, uh, you can have the sickle, I don't care. There you go. Alright, well, let's, I guess, get a little bit of wood. Try to make some, like, wood foundations. Jeez, look at all that. And, of course, I forgot, Terry does get a lot of fiber and stuff, too. So we can just harvest a little bit of fiber, just kind of tickle all that fiber over there. Let's try and get ourselves a bunch of, uh, wood foundations. I might as well pause the recording and get more, like, wood foundations off camera, because, ah, uh, you guys have seen me, like, crafting a bunch of stuff already, like, a billion times. I don't think you guys need to see me doing it a million more times, right? Jeez. <laughs> Anyways, uh, I don't know how we're going to need. How many, how many, like, holes? Okay, there's, like, two holes there. We might... I think you can build, like, two ceilings out from one foundation? I don't know how long. Oh, that one back there is a little bit longer than that one. So I think we're going to need four foundations. Eight ceilings? So let's try and make how many? Okay, we have two fountain wooden foundations right now. Guess I'm going to make two more wooden foundations and eight ceilings here off camera real quick. And I'll see you guys here in a second. We can build a bridge 
all the way across that, 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 that broken bridge, I guess you could call it. And, uh, actually, hold on, yeah. I should be able to just craft more lit foundations right now. Yep, there it is right there. I don't think it really matters if it's S plus or not, but we're probably going to keep it there forever anyways, right? Jeez. Let's see if we can make eight ceilings. Uh, we can only make one right now, and not enough resources. Probably need more wood. Okay. But let's try and get some more wood. Jeez, 187 right there. God, that's so good. The power harvesting, of course, is the attack with the claws and stuff whenever he twiddles his thumbs and stuff that is the delicate harvesting there we go and this is the power harvesting right there we get meat we get uh wood we get other stuff like that so that's pretty cool anyway ceilings let's try and make even more of those uh i don't know i think we need like seven more or something right uh, i can make three more right now okay whatever i'm going to pause the recording and try and make all the rest of these things and i'll see you guys here in a bit and we can place these down and make the i guess make a repair over that broken bridge over there so i'll see you guys here in a second I mean, it's back, and check it out, we do have the foundation right there. Let's place down these foundations. Hopefully we can still place them down while on top of Terry. So, oh, yes, it seems like that's the case. Let's try and place this about as far as we can, and try and make it, like, parallel with the actual thing itself so it doesn't go, like, off-center, and there we go. Okay, let's place down the ceilings now. I think you could place them out, too. Oh, we might not need to make a second, uh... Yeah, if we want to come back over that, we might want to... Yeah, let's place down the foundation. Try and place that, uh... Let's see, about right there-ish. That's about as good as it's going to get. Can we go back across this? Like this? Okay, so we can go across it that way, no problem. Now, what I'm curious about is, can we go... Oh, okay, 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 we can go back either way. No problemo, so that's good. That is awesome. Okay, so... Still have two foundations in our inventory. We still have... Oh, there's a scorpion up there, you can see that. So I guess we're going to be fighting both spiders, scorpions, well, I guess also bats as well, yeah. So that's going to be good. We're going to get some kiting up here with Terry, as well as, uh, I guess, like, spoiled meat and... I don't know what else we're going to get from those critters, but... Let's place down all these... I guess we're going to have extra ceiling. I can just throw them out. I don't care. Ooh, hold on. Yeah, can we... Yeah, you can't place another ceiling there. Yeah, it only comes out by two. So we're going to need to place down this... Ooh, can we even reach that from here? Can we reach that over there? Place this down? Oh, oh, yep, there it is right there. Okay. Ooh, this is kind of low, though. There we go. Let's try and make it to the other side. Uh, Terry has about 2,000 health. If anything, uh, I think I think that's decent. We might want to start upgrading melee damage here in a bit, though. So, anyways. Let's see if we can go across this way both ways. Yes, we can! Nice, nice! Okay, let's go over there now. And let's go kill some critters. And let's try and... I don't know how many things are going to be over here. Hopefully there's like juicy loot at the, like a treasure chest or maybe like a loot crate or something at the very top. Anyways, we've got a Scorpio fellow and he's down and out for the count. He's dead. Nice. Let's keep going. Let's try and enter this castle. Where in the world do you even enter it? I don't know. Oh, here we go. Here's, oh, yeah. There's a staircase right here. Hopefully you can actually go to the top very, uh, to the very, very top. Oh, a few crit, a lot of critters over here. Let's try and kill all these critters. There you go, oh, man. We're getting, we're getting damaged. We're getting webbed, uh, broken bones and stuff on Terry. We need to watch out for that. We need to watch out for myself as well. We did get, uh, some, some health brews, some, whatever you, whatever you call it. We got some of those from some of the tribes people that we killed earlier, though. So that's pretty good. You can see it in my inventory. I forgot to mention, I think. Anyways, we do have a spider behind us. Uh, oh, I also gave Terry some stimulants as well. Just in case you did get knocked out from, like, uh, any any scorpions that I try to fight for chitin, as well as uh, other stuff that might happen. But I guess we could also remember to use it here as well, if he ever does. Oh, oh, oh! Spider, spider, spider! Oh, my God, I've been trying last. I need to take some of that as uh, myself. There you go. Oof, there you go. All right, anything inside of that or any of inventory? I don't think so. I think we're good. Oof, we need to remember to get our hatchet out so we can... Oh! So we can at least get all of our chitin, no problem. There you go. Wow, we get a pretty good amount of chitin with that hatchet, too. Not even just counting, uh... Terry stuff, not but oh yeah, all that spoiled meat. Jeez, that weighs a lot. Yeah, get rid of that. Oh, let's get another. Uh, eh, let's get another melee damage. There we go. Two hundred sixty-six point six. Uh, two hundred sixty-six point three. Not bad. <laughs> uh, raw meat. I kind of want to keep the the regular prime meat in there as well, just so I'm you know dropping all the raw meat and still have a lot of stuff in our inventory. Anyways, let's go around here now. Stay in first person. Uh, there's not a way in there just yet. Like I said, hopefully we can actually go to the very top. Sort of like any stairs or bridges or anything at the very top. Man, I, I really don't want to, like, collect all this heckin'... Oh, there you go. Yeah, that's a lot better in third person. Whoa, man, we're getting swarmed, we're getting swarmed, we're getting swarmed. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Terry, you better heckin' survive. 
Jeez, you're doing damage. You're taking a lot of damage as well, Terry. You need to watch out. You have, like, no stamina right now. You need to watch out. Oh, my God, Terry. Terry, 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 Terry's getting his health heckin' drained, but he's killing everyone, though. Jeez, there we go. Oh, my God, kill that bat. Kill that bat. He's getting bloody. Terry is bloody as heck. He's got another level up. We can give him another melee damage as well. Oh, yeah, power harvesting as well. Give him some power harvesting, too. He's trying to reach in, although it's just this one spider, so there you go. Ooh, man, more spiders falling from the ceiling. That is very, very spooky. <laughs> Let's try to drop all that spore meat as well. And there's a lot of loot crates over here as well. Oh, he's got multiple level ups. There you go. Um, mm, you know what? Uh, oh, what in the world? Oh, he's got a blueprint in there. Spoiled meat. Let's try and drop all the spoiled meat. Ah, yeah, you know what? Yeah, let's keep doing melee damage. There we go. Keep on doing melee damage. Uh, is there anything else on it? Oh, yeah, like raw meat. Yeah, not really that much, but... Oh, another spider fell from the heavens. And it's dead. Let's go look at all the chests and stuff. Okay, let's get our sword out. I know it's not the best for harvesting. Uh, oh, my God, yeah. There's, like, metal tools and stuff here. Not bad. Let's get that. We can just go salvage it and get a little bit of metal as well. Not really the worst thing you need for... It. What in the world? Oh, that's an item cache. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't need that trash. Any uh, metal tools and stuff here? I'm going to take them. No problem. Oh, pipe. Yeah, the pike does weigh, like, 10 pounds, though. Mm. Like we're not if, if we get over encumbered, we just need to remember to ah, I might as well drop out these extra ceilings. I don't need garbage. Don't need that trash. Don't need to carry around that extra carry weight, especially if we're not gonna use it right. Oh! Oh, he's dying from a bat fella, bat fellow. Oh, and he's dead. I don't know what you get from hide and yep, hide and meat. Okay. See if we get any more metal tools and stuff over here that are you know, that's gonna give him me a little bit of metal whenever I salvage it and stuff. Not really too concerned about getting like uh like like cloth stuff. Yeah, I, don't really, I don't really care about that garbage. There you go. Alright, well, Terry, it looks like there's an opening right here. Let's see if we can go, like, up some stairs or something. Come on, Terry. Come on, Vominos. Everybody, let's go. Oh! Oh, there's a critter! There we go. 169 damage. Not bad. He was doing about 100 to 150 damage per hit to some Moranos I was killing earlier. You might have seen some, uh, sauropod vertebrae. Oh, whoa, we went in a circle now. Okay, that's where we came up. Now, is there a staircase around here somewhere? Yeah, there's like two or three. Oh, here we go. Yeah, there's like two more, two or three more layers. Ah, oh, Terry can't fit through that. Ooh. I guess we're going to have to go up that solo. We're going to have to go up there without you, Terry. Oh, glad I filled up my water jars and stuff. Eat a little bit of food, too. Let's go up. Uh, let's get our sword out, yeah. Like I said, we're not really here for harvesting chitin right now. Like, we have tons of that already. Probably a few thousand, to be quite honest. Oh, bats, bats, bats! Oh my god, okay, okay. I should probably put some uh, stimulus in my hot bar, just in case- we Oh yeah, just like that. Just in case we come across any spiders. We just easily give ourselves some stimulus to make sure we do not pass out and die. Oh my god, oh my god. Eat a little bit of that right now and put that in my hot bar. We have a few more coming down here. Oh, we're taking like no damage though. I couldn't really repair my armor earlier. I know, I know, I'm going to get comments saying, Hey, stop harvesting things with your sword, but... Man, I'm not here to harvest things, I'm here to kill! There you go. There you go, all right. Oh my god, there's- Oh! Oh yeah, that's a uh, rocket on my shoulder. Just throwing poop, literally throwing poop at everyone. Jeez. <laughs> oh, man, I'm getting insane amounts of spoiling me. I don't need that trash. There you go, kill that spider too. Jeez, we're getting a lot of good stuff over here, you guys. Uh, not really getting any- Oh, another bat fella, another bat fella. Oh, there you go. Level 40 touch. These guys are actually pretty decently leveled. Not bad. Although, we do have flak armor, and we have some pretty good, uh, protection against everyone. Against all these critters. I think I do, like, no damage. And then again, I do have, like, 600 or so armor rating. Uh, not even 600. I think that was, uh, Arc, uh, Aberration. I think we have 2,000. Yeah, 2,500 armor rating. God, that's good stuff. Not bad. All right, let's kill these spiders and bats. Oh, my hat! My hat broke! No! Okay, let's kill this guy. Okay, let's, let's switch. Oh, my God. Okay. I want to go switch. I, I know I have some more hats. I don't know what hat we can wear right now. Oh, we have more critters heading towards us. There we go. I don't know if I can go. Yeah, let's go to third person. It might be a little bit better for you guys to view. Now, there's the oh, there's another critter right there. Hopefully we can get him. Yeah, there you go. That's one of the downsides of melee damage is that you have to, you know, it's, it's melee. Uh, what was I doing? Oh, yeah. Uh, I guess we could wear this hat. There we go. 63, 63 armor rating isn't really that much, but it's better than nothing, right? Jeez. <laughs> Anyways, we do have another staircase right here. Let's get our sword back out. We seem to be doing pretty well on health, stamina, and uh, hunger, and, and water. We've got a water jar that's still half full in our hot bar. Oh, not the bad over here. Let's go back to first person. There we go. 70 level 71. Yeah, these guys are high levels. Heck yeah, we're getting... Speaking of level 71, I think we might be... Level 79, man. We might be getting close to a level... Yep, we're getting pretty close to level 76. Not bad. Wah! Harvest of dead trash. We got another stereo. This has got to be the roof right here, right? We've got to get some juicy loot here in a bit. 
Mm, it might be. It might be. Let's see. Is there going to be a, maybe an explorer note? Then again, I've never seen an explorer note in Ar Ark uh, Ragnarok. Ah, uh, well, so far. <laughs> I think I think there's literally nothing up here, you guys. <laughs> I think there's literally nothing up here. Are you kidding me? We came up here for the well, I guess if anything, we did get a you know, we killed a lot of critters, we got a lot of cane, a lot of spoiled meat, which I definitely do want to drop. God, we have so much of that. I don't even need the raw stuff uh spoiled. Uh whoops. Drop all that garbage. I don't need that trash. Uh what's it? Raw meat, yeah, I'll drop that too. I don't care. Jeez. Hmm. I don't even I didn't even use that health brew that healing potion. Well, either way, I'm, let's, I might have missed something up here. I'm probably going to get comments. Let me just double check just to make sure we do not miss like a... That'd be really good if they had like a like a, like a a chest, like a large storage box, and it had some loot inside of it, you know? Ah, that'd be good, but man, there's like literally nothing down here, though. God. Okay, let's go back down to Terry. I'm um, like, we, we mainly came over here to get some chitin so we can make, you know, some major base to make the, uh, the vault and uh, to also get organic Palmer, you know, to also make the vault, so... And not really that bad. I'm like, we did have a little adventure. I did want to come over here a long time ago, so I'm glad that we finally came over here and explored a little bit. Where in the world do we go now? Oh, there we go. And this should be, is this Terry? No. Oh, I think this is Terry down here. Yep, there he is right there. Oh, I guess he killed another spitter fella. All right, well, I guess we're going to drop down. I like we could drop down, or we could just take the br- uh, Yeah, we could drop down and take the bridge, okay. Or we could just drop down to the swamps. Not that big of a deal. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, you, you got another level up. Uh, I guess we can give him a... Uh, I don't know. Carry weight, melee damage. Let's give him some more melee damage. Up to 289%. Really, really good stuff. See if we can find some more critters down here. More Manti. And of course, we do have the bees right there. The bees' knees. And a Capra. Sucus. Couple Capros. Hashtag couple Capros. Oh! Oh, that's one of the things I wanted to watch out for. It's whenever I, those guys like jump towards me and then I get like caught in their mouth. Don't want that to happen. Jeez, there's Terry. What is Terry doing? Is he thinking he must be fighting? He better be fighting someone. He better not be just run away because he's scared. Get over here. What are you doing, Terry? Man, you scared of cat? You're over here with like 2,000 health, almost 300% melee damage. You're over here running away from all the creators. I don't know. Maybe it was running towards like the Capra Sugus, but I guess because he's in the water, he's like super slow. Anyways. What in the world was that noise? Sounds like a large critter. It might be a Sarko. It might be. Oh, it's a Carno. Or maybe. Oh, that's a Carno. That's that. That's definitely. Oh man, we got like a thousand wood right there. What? <laughs> okay, that thing's getting away. Jeez. Uh, wood. There you go. Let's drop all that. Man, that's crazy. We better not get be. Uh, we better not be a dismounted from the Caprasucus. And there's the Carnos coming back, and he's dead. And a little bit of rare mushroom is not bad. All right. Well, God, I need to get all that wood. I have so much wood in my inventory. I don't need that garbage. Uh, any, like, spoiled meat or anything like that? Uh, no, no, no. Oh, yeah, there's a little bit of spoiled meat right there. I guess we could keep those rare mushrooms as well. Let's keep going around here, see if we can find some more critters. Hopefully mantises and stuff, too. Oh, other cabbage. Oh, wait, that's a Utah Raptor. Just a classic Utah Raptor. I haven't seen one of those guys in a little bit. Nah. See if we can find some more mantises around here. Oh, a cave! Oh! Sarko inside the cave! Just killing the Sarko, there you go, level 12. Not bad, a little bit of high and all that other stuff. Let's go inside the cave. Oh man, you guys. I have a feeling we're gonna find... Oh! Jeez, that just turned like instantly black right there, but... <laughs> okay. Um... I get... I don't... Can we make a torch right now? Nah, I can't make a torch right now. Okay, let's go make a torch. I don't know what we need. Probably, uh, like, flint and stone and... Wood or thatch or something like that, you know? I guess we just go get a little bit of wood from somewhere real quick. I guess we can just, I don't know, go hit a rock or something. Oh, jeez, I don't know what's out there. Sheesh, let's get it like a rock. Oh, a little bit of metal, a little bit of flint, a little bit of stone, and I'm sure that we got everything else in our inventory already, right? Jeez. Uh, or in Terry's inventory. Let's try to make like two torches. Oh, not enough. What in the world am I missing? Oh, one piece of wood. Okay. I get that like... Right now, oh, there's a Beelzebuff, a big old frog fella. Let's try and get a little bit of wood right there, and let's try and make two torches. I guess I have to... There it goes, two. That way I can have one in my inventory, and then put the other one in Terry's inventory, you know? Uh, that kind of sounded Canadian right there, you know? <laughs> Anyways, let me drop that wood out there. I don't really need that extra carry weight just kind of slowing me down, you know? Anyways, uh, give that to you. Got a 
scroll all the way down here, and then there we go. And I keep the extra one, extra one in my inventory. Let's go back in that cave. Hopefully this actually, this actually lights it up a little bit more than it did earlier. Or is it going to turn to black? Oh, there we go. Really dark right now, you guys. This is crazy. Okay, let's just... I don't know if we're going to find that death worm or anything inside of here, you guys. <laughs> I don't know if I should even be here. Should I turn around? I don't know. Oh, my God. Ooh, a little bit of... Oh, lag, lag. I don't even... Okay, I'm trying to be careful, trying to be quiet as well. In case anything pops out, you know. But if anything pops out, I will be ready to defend myself. Oh, man. Oh, what in the world does that sound? I don't know. Maybe very careful here, you guys. Maybe go back to first person. See a little bit easier. Maybe there's going to be an artifact down here. I forgot about those things, right? Jeez. Okay, we're getting a little bit of a shelter thing going on right now. Oh, man. We're getting so deep in here. We haven't even found anything yet. Jeez. Rocks that kind of look like mushrooms, but we're not in aberration. Maybe this is down to aberration. Is this going to take me down to aberration? <laughs> Just go see that nasty little Danny DeVito critter. I'm a goblin. Oh my god, this is crazy. We're still going down, down. Is that water? What is that? That is water. Whoa. What in the world is down here? Is this just a... I'm hearing like sounds. Oh man, you guys, this is crazy. I hope we can just pass through here. I see foliage over here. I'm hearing critters making noises. Whoa, giant plants. Wow. 65er. These are gigantic plants. I don't know if I should be down here, you guys. I don't know. I I feel like something's going to pop out. Something's going to happen. Something's going to attack us. We're going to die or something. Oh, yeah. We still have a rocket on our shoulder. Is that a critter? No, it's just more gigantic foliage, which doesn't even make sense. There's like no sunlight down here. It seems like there's something over there. Let's try and get a stamina break just in case anything happens. We can, you know, uh, we have a lot of stamina. We can just kind of use to murder whatever, whoever. I wonder if this actually takes us out or if we have to actually turn around to actually leave the cave. I don't think I can harvest these mushrooms, right? Yeah. Oh, what in the world? I can, like, see through the world. I don't know if I want to keep going forward. There you go. I don't know if I want to keep going forward, but I keep going forward, right? Oh, oh, what in the heck? There's light over here from something. Is that sunlight or... What could possibly be lighting that up? Man, I don't know, you guys. We're getting so off track over here, we do have a little up. Uh, melee damage, yeah. Man, I don't know, you guys. This place is so crazy. There's going to be critters in the water, I bet. Ah, man, good thing that wasn't the case. At least right there. Didn't get attacked. But there's got to be something going on down here, right? Like, I'm already lost. I don't even... If I try to head back, I don't know where to go. Oh, man, you guys. If we died, I don't know how to get back here other than, you know, the Death Fighter, which it does stop working after a while. After your stuff, like, despawns and stuff, so... Oh my god, there's so much stuff. I can't even really see that well, like two feet in front of me that much, you know? Ah, oh, man. <laughs> I really, 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 really shouldn't have come over here, huh? Oh, man, more mushrooms over there. There's got to be something down here, like an artifact or something. Okay, we're tired again. And there we go, up to stamina right there. Got some, got some obsidian over here, okay. Whew. Bioluminescent mushrooms. I could get some obsidian, but don't really need it. We need obsidian, we can always just, get, you know, go get it. At the top of the mountain, where we basically are at the other base. But don't need to come down here into a cave to get obsidian, I'll tell you that much. <laughs> Especially whenever, you know, you get lost so easily in here. God, ooh. Not the passageway that way. It kind of heads down, though. I don't want to go down anymore. Oh, we're going down, though. You got... Oh! Metal! It's just like a ch Oh. I think it just loaded me into a new area. Is there anything back here? Just roots and stuff. Man! 
I really should not be here, you guys. You're falling down, not taking too much damage like at all. Which is always good. Have we reached the bottom? Have we reached the depths? Like, we were already pretty deep just moments ago. That's gotta be Terry making that noise. I'm not seeing, like, anything. Like I said, I've only seen and fought and killed one Melosaurus. I don't know if I want to see anything else. Man, this place is crazy, though. Hopefully our torch doesn't break, but then again, we have a lot of resources. We just craft, like, a thousand more. <laughs> Ah, kind of want to use this opportunity to fill up my water jar and stuff. There you go. Drink some stuff as well. We are next to water. Might as well take advantage of it. I feel like maybe... Uh, yeah, it feels like we're back here now. I think I might know like it. Uh, I don't want to get too confident here. I can't use my pickaxe right now. But I think I remember I was like, oh, how's that lit up like five minutes ago? So let's keep going around here. Maybe taking some of the stuff out of Terry's inventory, because he is getting over encumbered. Okay, yeah, I remember going through this tunnel right here, yeah. Now I just kind of need to backtrack, because, man, there's probably something here. You guys are probably leaving comments. I probably need to do some research on it, like, hey, there's a cave in, the, in that swamp area. Well, I'm wondering what's over there. Maybe come back here a little bit later when we're more prepared. But let's see if we have anything over here we can just drop. Yeah, we have a little bit of wood. Mm-hmm. Drop that trash. I don't need that garbage. Anything else here I don't need? Ah, don't need that pike. Don't need that pike. Swords, of course, give us some good metal, and they weigh less, too. Speed of metal, I do have a little bit of raw metal in my inventory. Nothing really major, so don't really need to worry about that. I think we went this way. Came from this way? Ah, we're trying to backtrack our way out of here now, you guys. This is crazy. We haven't really found anything down here. Ah, this has got to be just, like, a base area where you could just, like, build your own base. Oh. That was a wall. See, I told you, I can't even, like, see, like, right in front of me. Uh. <laughs> I really don't want to, like, ghost cheat out of here, because... Kind of defeats the purpose and stuff, but, man, I need to either, like, watch my own footage or something, because we just found some death. Did we, like, fall out of the ceiling or something over here? Is that why I'm, like, lost? Uh. I don't think so. I think it's genuinely just, like, a big old dead end. Man, where do we go? Maybe to the right a little bit, but of course we need to regain a little bit more stamina now. Let's try and just keep going this way then. Here we go, yeah. Here's a path. Here we go. Ooh, what is that up there? Oh, I think that's the foliage. Yep, yep, this is the room where I saw the giant foliage. Yeah, okay, we're, we're making progress here, you guys. <laughs> That's good. That's good. We're, we're finding the foliage. And we're slowly making our way back, so... Hopefully I can actually remember, like, all the things we passed and stuff, too. Let's try and take another stamina break here where it's relatively safe. Hopefully we can make our way out of here without me needing to pause the recording and do it off camera. I think it might just be a straight way out of here now. Feels like it. Uh, yeah, yeah, we're getting a lot of elevation here, you guys. Yeah, I think we found our way out. <sighs> Don't want to get too ahead of myself here, but I think we found our way out. Hopefully we actually get the little lighting change and it gets all bright again here in a second. This has got to be the way out. Yeah, we, we, we gained too much elevation there. This has got to be it. I totally remember this. Man, yeah, aren't there? I need to upgrade, like, a stamina and stuff, too, here. Like... <laughs> He keeps running out of stamina so fast. And of course he does lose stamina using attacks and stuff, so I do not want him to lose- Oh! Oh, jeez, did they get- Oh, the game didn't crash right there. Okay, that's good. I think we might have found our way out here, you guys. Is this it? Is this it? Oh! This is it! There's the swamp! Oh my jeez, that is like so bright. Did you guys see that? Everything was like basically white. Anyways, now, now we found our way out of there. Gee, that is so good. Oof, man, have I ever been so thankful to see a swamp. <laughs> Anyways, I think because now we finally made our way out of there, and yeah, so far we're not seeing any more mantises, which would have been really good, you know, just to try and get some more organic, organic palmer and stuff from them. But, uh, 
Yeah, I'm not seeing any more of them right there. Anyways, I think we got a lot of good, you know, exploring and stuff done over here. Just kind of got sidetracked. That's probably going to be its own episode. <laughs> but we did get a lot of kite and got a lot of uh, organic palmer as well. We should be able to make the vault no problemo. And then I'm going to have to do some off-camera work to actually move all the critters over to the raft, which shouldn't be too hard. Uh, probably about 30 minutes of off-camera work, no problem. But... Once we get back home, let's go make that vault. Let's go load it up with as much, you know, valuable stuff that we actually want to bring along. Don't really need to bring, like like I said earlier, don't really need to bring, like, resources like wood and fiber and all that kind of trash. Oh, another pygmy thing here. Let's try and kill it. It's kind of stuck behind a rock. Let's try and kill it. 135 damage here and there. Let's try and get some good damage. It's basically stuck. It's basically like shooting fish in a barrel. How much I can health does this thing have? Jeez. It's a pink one, though. Oh, there's the pink one. has been murdered. Level 21. 9 plus 10. This one has the sword coming out of it. Yeah. Oh! Whoa! Assault rifle and a fabricated pistol. Whoa! Yep, I'm not complaining one a bit. Really good stuff from that one. Yeah, whoa. And there's the Alpha Dodigerous. Looks like he wants to fight me for whatever reason. <laughs> he finally fell off the mountain, huh? Get out of here, you piece of trash. Anyways. I think we should be able to outrun him, at least, as long as we don't run out of stamina, right? Jeez. But yeah, look at that. He, he's keeping up pace, but once we get to the water, hopefully he doesn't swim super fast, right? Jeez. <laughs> Anyways, I think I'm going to pause the recording, make my way back home, and then we can finally make the vault, load it up with all the good, valuable stuff, and then I'll load up the raft with all the uh, all the other critters, load up my ark here in ark. <laughs> and I'll see you guys here in a bit. Man, I'm still getting pursued by the Alpha Dode, but... Like I said earlier, I think we should be able to outrun him. <laughs> yeah, he's already turning around. He knows there's a Skeletal fella right there. Skeletal track. <laughs> well, maybe here in the future. He has a level 4, I think it was. Oh, yeah, wasn't there an Alpha Stegger out here? Uh, it was like a billion years ago when it first tamed our Red Bull, so we could be anywhere by now. Anyways, go ahead and pause the recording, make my way back home, and I'll see you guys here in a bit. <laughs>